اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم نحمد و نسولی علی رسول کریم اما بعد پاؤز باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اللہ صلی علی محمد و علال محمد ان کا ماس فلّ تعالی ابراہیم و علال ابراہیم ان کا حمید المجید اللہ بارک علی محمد و علال محمد ان کا ما بارک تعالی ابراہیم و علال ابراہیم ان کا حمید المجید السلام علیکم دراستی گڈ مارننگ ہر کلا راشی ٹوڈے I would like to discuss about the most important concept of the deep map. It is depictive of genes arrest concept. What is depictive of genes arrest concept? To understand better, You must know the structure of genes and the importance and function of genes. Genes, it is that part of ADNA molecule which is responsible for the transmission of minimum one protein or minimum one trait from parents to the offspring. They are arranged in chromosomes. Chromosomes, half of the chromosomes occurs from the mother and half of the chromosomes occurs from the father in all human beings with exception, some embryological exceptions. The creation of Hazrat Adam was the exception the creation of Hawa Bibi was exception and the creation of Isa alayhi salam was exception to these normal embryological roles. Nowadays when a baby comes in the world half of the properties are transmitted from the mother and half of the properties are transmitted from the father. It is the structure of normal genes. The function of normal genes to transfer one good character or one normal protein, minimum one, from parents to offspring. And this combination of DNA material occurs after marriages. Therefore, in order to discuss in detail what is faulty gene or what is defective gene. It should be hard that if a disease, for example kidney stone disease or if cholelithiasis, gallbladder stone disease, or sugar, diabetes mellitus, or hypertension, HDN, it is now clear that they are transmitted from parents to offspring, familial character, family history, and they are in detail explained by Mendel in Mendel laws of inheritance. In medicine, the role of depictive genes arrest concept is that that it completely eradicates congenital abnormalities. How to eradicate congenital abnormalities? We must know about some factors that influence our baby's health. That is the first trimester of pregnancy and the mass period which is neglected all over the world. Those 
couples who are intended to have babies, they should abort some medicines, some environmental factors, heat, deficiencies of vitamins, minerals and iron, they all should be avoided in order to prevent congenital abnormalities in intrauterine life. The other abnormalities which are transferred from parents to offspring, for example, diabetes mellitus, nephrolithiasis, they can transfer the disease from the parents to the offspring. We must have premarital medical consultation. We must have free environment. We must have balanced diet and safe and health-friendly environment for pregnant females. The other factors which influence the transfer of genes from parents to offspring, this is Toba. What is Toba? What is repentance before Allah? It is to feel shame of your past bad deeds, to believe in Allah and to repent for your sins. Allah forgives sins, Allah accepts repentance till death. The other factor which can reduce environmental hazard, which can reduce congenital abnormalities, it is pray, to pray God, to pray Allah. To pray Allah, oh Allah, give me healthy and good children, babies. I think that it will be sufficient for today before leaving my channel. I am heartily thankful to English speakers, especially for their encouraging, for their comments, for their likes by their shares and subscription. All English speakers belonging to any region of the world, belonging to any religion of the world, belonging to any nation of the world, we respect and deep map is your project. You can reduce diseases in your countries. I can reduce it in my countries. You can reduce diseases in your homes. I shall try to reduce diseases in my home. It will be continued. Heat is also teratogenic. Keep away pregnant women from mosquito bites, from infections, from heat, from noise, pollution, infections, efficiencies, conditions. They should be treated with Priority, especially poor orphans, widows, immigrants, and refugees. Thank you very much. Goodbye, the Sudaniya, the Allah Paman program, inshallah, Jari Satu.